Hello friends. So talking about the HDFC, the Housing Development Finance Corporation, this firm, this bank, how this is uh, fighting the COVID in terms of attracting more financing and funds and being more relevant. So uh, to this context, we see it attracted investment from People's Bank of China in this difficult environment. Uh, the Chinese bank is already having somewhere around uh, 1% and it is uh, 1% uh, shareholding in the firm and it is expected to further raise it. Now, uh, we have seen even other countries uh, uh, investing in this, firms from other countries investing like Abu Dhabi, uh, investment coming from there, then uh, Singapore also invests in this bank and have its equity. So overall, we see uh, some form of global investments involved in HDFC, and that is uh, very helpful to diversify the kind of uh, capacity the bank holds. So I'm sure uh, the chairman, uh, Deepak Parekh, must be very... Uh, uh, happy with this that in the current difficult pandemic era where uh, uh, we don't know which nation uh, can have a difficult time and have a difficult financial system so it is uh, important to have a diversified investment portfolio uh, where you, diversified way you are attracting investments and you have stakeholders now, definitely the investments is largely uh, from the bank, is largely within India. Uh, and that is uh, not a big uh, problem as of now because normally the investments done in the housing sector, uh, proper LTV ratio is seen, the loan to value, and that helps the uh, bank to be certain that their money is not lost and the uh, the the propensity of the subprime crisis, what happened in the U.S. market back 10 years back, is something which is of very little probability to happen in a market like India. The reason being that we have a lot of uh, development scope and the regulatory environment is also not that relaxed that it can be misused grossly as had happened earlier in the United States uh, financial crisis times by the banks in that country. So here uh, the regulations are strict and the, the kind of loans and the banks are also, and overall the Indians are more conservative in lending and more careful. So, so those dimensions are definitely helping the uh, the operations happening within India. So the bank is placed well in these difficult times and they are looking to cope up well in this uh, COVID environment. Thank you.